Hi guys, DoubleDrakeSpyZ, and we are hopefully finishing up Shantae Half Genie Hero, as we're pretty much near the end of this. At this point, we have like a choice, either head to Risky's hideout and defeat her once and for all, or stay and gather some clues as to what her plans really are. Oh, so I just realized the uh, magical tiara is different here. Huh. So I guess it made a difference. So I technically do have unlimited magic per se, but it's more like it gradually regenerates. Well, I mean, it was different in normal game as it just had unlimited magic. So here... I, it just regenerates my magic gauge, which I guess in that case I should have been the that should have been the better option because using the tiara just kind of breaks the game in, in normal mode anyway. <laughs> All right, so uh, in order to get the additional clues, what we have is to talk to these guys. <laughs> yeah, surprisingly, all the barons are back in this little town for some weird reason. Techno Baron, what are you doing way out here? Pure procrastination. I've been assigned 1 billion hours of community service. They're making me tear down my factory to make way for a putrid mermaid preserve. Yeah. Well, that's what you get, I, I suppose. The sooner you get back to work, the sooner you'll be done. Try whistling. <laughs> never, 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 I say. I refuse to live a single digit until someone recovers my data chip. I hid it in the factory. It has all my financials on it. Find it. Find it, I say. Well, luckily I managed to have it. Gave data chip. It's mine. Had it over. <laughs> well then, I have no reason not to give you a reward suitable for a peasant such as yourself. Risky's cufflink. What are you looking at? Take your reward and leave me. Thanks, Techno Baron. Good luck becoming financially solvent. <laughs> yeah, so weirdly, all the clues are more or less just risky as a stuff. <laughs> Not exactly sure why, but, you know. Hypno Baron, what are you doing here? It's impossible to work with that moronic squid baron. I have started. Uh, so I'm starting over fresh. I refuse to be. Reduced to comical banter. I will rebuild an empire of fear by feeding on sunken souls. I command you to find ten of them. Fail in this, and I will inhabit the minds of all the citizenry of Scuttle Town, driving them to madness. That sounds more like the Hypno Baron I know. <laughs> Bring me the sunken souls. <laughs> well, luckily, I have all ten. You gave sunken souls. See how they quiver in. Rickle had the in fear of their master. You have done well. I will give you a gift. You got Risky's ribbon. That object is an ornament of pure hatred. Thanks, Hypno Baron. Good luck building your fear empire. <laughs> Ammo Baron, what are you doing here? <laughs> What's it look like? I'm shopping for spare parts. Until I repair my ship and get her airborne, my entire fleet's, fleets will end up just burning fuel. If I had five pieces of scrap metal, I could fix my ship and get out of your lousy hair. Well, hold the phone. Is that scrap metal for yours truly? Uh, yeah, of course. Got all five pieces. You know, you ain't half bad, babe. <laughs> I'm gonna share a little secret with you. I had a run-in with old Missy Boots some time ago and she dropped this. You got Risky's Pendant. <laughs> Never like how that gal throws her weight around. Maybe that thing will help her take, help you take her down, Peg, eh? Keep it between you and me. <laughs> Alright, so that's three out of the four clues. Put that in quotes. I wouldn't really say these are actual clues. Oh, look. Squid Baron. Yo, you're here? I thought I destroyed you in the battle. 
Nah, you get over the explosions and screen clearing blasts after a while. <laughs> no perma harm done. But check this out. Have you seen all the Squid Baron fan art in this place? I'm some sort of global phenomenon. In fact, here. You got Velvet Poster. I had to take some artwork down to make room for more pics of me. But this is someone's artwork. Some person poured their heart and soul into this. Nah, toss it. No way. I'm gonna find a good home. I <laughs> find it a good home. Well, luckily, with that poster at hand. <laughs> which I kind of find strange. Squid Baron just ripped someone's poster out of the gallery. <laughs> Seriously, that's like going into a museum and taking down artwork. Well, anyway, now that I have that, I have the poster. Okay. Uh, no matter what evil recipe she's been cooking up, you can be sure I'm going to bite it. <laughs> uh, okay, then. <laughs> well, before I head off to battle... There's one thing I gotta do real quick. I mean, this is not gonna. Luckily, this is not gonna take too long. Well, there's Risky's hideout, but I gotta go to Hypno Baron's castle real quick. Because there's something I gotta get. Would you like to save? No. Alright, so I need to find Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Drop down here for a sec. This place needs a poster, like an awesome poster. Abner. <laughs> oh yeah. Well I already Played this, that's right. Well, I mean, I had to restart the stage, but yeah, it's, uh... Yeah, so, I mean, it's the same dialogue, so, alright. Nothing any different. <laughs> alright, you gave Velvet Poster. This ain't, a, this ain't at all what I expected. It's way better. Yeah, I'm digging this. Here. You got squid poster. <laughs> Poe picked it up. That scary looking squid poster at, at a nerd con. No backsies. <laughs> Stay classy, Abner. <laughs> so with that in hand. <laughs> gotta go back to Scuttletown real quick. Alright, since I got the poster, heading back to Squid Baron and to give it to him. Keep the Squid Baron fan art coming. Hey, that Squid poster you look you have looks epic. Give me that. Sure thing. Uh, yes, I've got to have this laminated. Here, something for you in return. You got Risky's buckle. Looks like it broke off a size 7 fashionable leather boot. That smelled great. <laughs> well, so now that I have all pieces of clues, <laughs> I mean, I'm not really sure exactly what all this stuff is really going to tell me exactly, but let me just heal myself one more time.
So, will we battle risky boots head on and stop her quickly, or will we search for the four clues and formulate a plan of attack? Choice is yours. Hello, Gungo. I found something. He gave Risky's buckle. <laughs> I think this is Risky's buckle. Let's have a look at that. Hmm. It appears to be cracked or caked in ash from a metal forge. I'll keep studying it. Good work. <laughs> Any more clues? Risky's cufflink. Well, this could be Risky's cufflink. Uh, let's have a look at that. Hmm. There's a smudge from sealant often used with insulated rubber hoses. I'll keep studying it. Good work. Let's see. Risky's pendant. Let's see. There are old oil spots dotted on the surface. Not your typical grade either. Alright, last one. Risky's ribbon. It smells of sulfur. What she's... Well, what she's building uses great heat as a power source. I'll keep studying it. Good work. <laughs> That's everything I could find, Uncle. <laughs> Perfect. With these four clues at hand, I should be able to decipher her plan. One moment. Just a matter of where she went and which materials she was after. Water dispersal... Dispersal requires... No, that's not it. Something to amplify the counterflow. No, she would have known about the hamster wheel. Yes, a much larger magical intake valve. Eureka! Here's your answer. You got magical polarizer. What's this? <laughs> that is a magical polarizer. With this item, you can cancel the inversion process and redirect the magic like a lightning rod. Huh? If you if that pirate tries to switch your magic, you can switch it right back again. Cool. Will it, it really work? No idea, but it's better than nothing. <laughs> Come on, she's got this. Go kick her buns, champ. <laughs> yes, it is. Let's go for it. Uh, yeah. I mean, granted, I could spend some time just trying to get some, well, you know, gem farming, I guess. I could spend some time getting everything, but I really don't have to. I mean, I already have everything I technically need. Let's just head over to Risky's Hideout. And of course, yeah, save. <laughs> After all, this is the final fight. This is the place. Risky Boots is hiding the dynamo somewhere close by. One final word of warning. It's you. If the enemy succeeds in turning the genie realm to evil, you must destroy us and our magic with us. Hesitate and your world will fall forever into darkness. I understand. I believe in what my friend said. I can't think of myself as half good enough anymore. Everyone in Scuttle Town, Sequent Land, the entire genie realm is counting on me. I'll stop Risky Boots at any cost. Okay. Time to do this. <laughs> so. <laughs> Yeah, so crazily, what we have here is a side scroller. Just trying to attack anything in my path. Of course, along the way, if you can save these starfish, they can actually help you out. Uh, there's so many things at once. <laughs> oh, we have some more of the Tinker Bats. Oh, 
But I need this real quick. <laughs> Oh, okay. <laughs> wow. It's just so many things on the screen at once. <laughs> so I'm kind of losing track of myself sometimes, so that's kind of the problem. Hmm. All right, actually, maybe first thing what I should do is... Um Get a few oranges just to help me out a little bit. <laughs> yeah, unfortunately, these things have like a wide explosive range. It's kind of annoying, actually. Just trying to stay at one spot so I just keep shooting. Oh. <laughs> so many. <laughs> the Tinker Bats are just. Gonna need the oranges. Oh, come on. <laughs> Just how much more I gotta do this? Thank God. <laughs> I reached the end. <laughs> yes, save the game. All right. Just a few more fruits just to help me out a little bit. And I guess also use the... Uh, I guess there's the life recover. Man. I gotta use the elephant stomp, hold on. Okay. <laughs> All right, this is going to be a tricky part here, isn't it? <laughs> of course, I can just fly across to help me out a little bit. <laughs> 
I mean, why bother platforming when I have everything at my disposal to do this? That's all I got, huh? Oh, come on. Actually, I'll tree again. <laughs> Alright, next area. Oh, come on. That was a really lousy spot. <laughs> well, luckily, I have the Harpy Talon. Ah, God. I mean, it's hard to just land. That's the problem. Oh, oh, close. Come on. Just keep attacking. <laughs> Oh man, it's getting kind of crazy here. All right, uh, heal myself again. So much damage. All right, so <laughs> it's time to travel. Oof. Oh, ah. Oh, God, I can't even see where I'm landing. Whoa, 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 whoa. Come on. Oh, man. Oh, God. It's difficult to control the harpy. It's like trying to... It's like trying to use a... Trying to fly a bad airplane. Is <laughs> the best way to put it. Man. <laughs> oh, whoa, whoa. Come on. Settle. Settle. Fly, fly. <laughs> Just keep flying. Ignore everything.
<laughs> so many things attacking me at once here. Okay. Oh, ah! <laughs> Jump too far. Come on. Just... Control it. Control it. Ah! <laughs> I'm trying. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, man. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, I didn't see it. <laughs> it doesn't have to be this hard. Man, if, we, if only the controls were a little bit better. Man, it's trying to like trying to play Flappy Bird here with all these obstacles. All right, just fly, fly. Oh man, <laughs> that was kind of tricky. Looks like this is the end of the line. It must be getting close now. Yeah, I guess so. Of course, there's here's the final save spot in case you want it. <laughs> I mean, I don't know why they bother having a save spot right before and then a save spot afterward. <laughs> All right, right on schedule. I figured a goody two shoes like you might find a way to reverse the effects of the dark magic. I assure you the process is now irreversible. Where's the dynamo, Risky? Yes, where is the dynamo? You'll see soon enough. It's in the tender love and care of my Tinker Bats. My men have been working tirelessly to unlock the dynamo's full potential. It will be beyond anything your short-sighted uncle could have ever dreamed of. But until their work is complete, I won't allow you to interfere. Risky Boots, Queen of the Seven Seas. Oh. She seems... Oh, man. She seems a lot faster compared to normal difficulty. Oh. Jesus. <laughs> That's a lot of damage. Oh. Oh. I'm trying, I'm trying. <laughs> Hold on. Heal. <laughs> I should probably heal myself again. Oh god, the cannon fire now. And now the anchor. <laughs> Trying my best to stay alive here, but it's not easy. I mean, I want the challenge, and I'm getting it. <laughs> Okay, uh, no, bad idea. <laughs> Gotta be careful because I don't have 
any magic right now. Oh, man. <laughs> God, pretty fast. <laughs> well, if you can give me some health and magic, that would be nice. Wow, come on. <laughs> I'm trying to survive here. <laughs> oh, she had to land on top of me. Man, <laughs> tricky battle. <laughs> no joke. I mean, I'm not fully maxed out in power and everything, but still. <laughs> I mean, I thought it would be doable. <laughs> Oop, ah, I didn't mean to do that. Ray saved. I don't understand why the guy's even here. I hate when she keeps running right into me. Oh, man. Uh, I mean, at least luckily, Risky kind of goes into like a pattern. Again. Oh, cannon fire, of course. I'm trying. Ugh, gotta use up the oranges. Wow. <laughs> oh. oh, come on. Can do this. <laughs> I can do this. A little bit of magic. Man.
Come on. <laughs> Just go down already. Oh, man. Okay, I mean, luckily this risky goes into a set pattern. Man. <laughs> Man, I just gotta watch out for that scimitar strike. <laughs> Does a good amount of damage. Good, more health. <laughs> wow. Man, just gotta keep healing myself just to even say a, stand a chance. Oh, thank God. <laughs> oh, I wasn't sure how much longer I could deal with that. Yes, it is. Give up. Ha. Huh. Oh no. <laughs> now I'll introduce you to the final phase of my plan. Whoa, what's this? Behold. Yes, what is this? <laughs> the new and improved dynamo. What have you done to it? My Tinker Bats have increased its potential in every way. My moment of victory has arrived. Watch as I turn your precious genie realm inside out. <laughs> oh no. She's going to open the gateway to the genie realm. I've got to destroy the dynamo before it's too late. <laughs> the Tinker Brain, Dynamo of Destruction. <laughs> Oh. 
All right, so I just gotta keep going in a certain direction. Oh wow, that's different. <laughs> Didn't see that happen. Oh, man. I was trying to build up some... Wow. Oh. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> I mean, so this is different, adding in a laser grid now. Just keep going. I just try not to get hit by the gears, but at the same time. Well, at least that's one down. <sighs> wow, okay. Wow, that laser is getting so close. Oh man. Oh, come on. Oh man. Just try to do this here. Oh man. Come on. I'm so close. I should maybe heal myself real quick. I want to go down. Oh, wow. Laser. Very close. All right. <laughs> There's that. Okay, <laughs> at least I destroyed it. 
took some time, but at least I did it. <laughs> and mostly just having to dodge the lasers was the hard thing. Whew, that was close. I deactivated the dynamo just in time, and the genie realm is safe and sound. Or is it? Huh? That voice. You've battled valiantly and accomplished so much. Daughter of the genies, it's you. You've risked your life time and uh, time and again into into fight for justice and the service to others. And we are forever grateful for your kindness and your loyalty. Oh wow, we're in the genie realm. On behalf of the entire genie realm, we thank you from the bottom of our hearts. No. Oh. Hmm, seems pretty magical actually. Unfortunately, huh? The corruption of our magic has begun. Do what you must to ensure peace. Risky, where'd she come from? I finally done it. The very heart of the realm of magic. Kind of vaguely, why does Risky even want the power of the genie realm anyway? Why does she want all? Why is she even bothering? No real explanation, but she just wants it. Uh, now, do my bidding. Submit to me as your absolute ruler. Oh no. <laughs> it worked. The power of the genius is mine, and the world will bow before me. Uh, this is kind of the most insert. <laughs> it's kind of the most absurd thing that Risky's ever really done, and kind of more even weird considering uh, how it was in the last game. <laughs> I don't have any choice. Before Risky can claim their power, I have to do it. I have to destroy the genie realm at any cost. Oh man, I wonder how hard this is going to be. <laughs> so I got to destroy the dynamo machine. I'm trying to heal myself a little bit. Okay. Ow. It's got to be careful and just keep dodging attacks. Alright, doing well, just keep trying to destroy the machine by attacking the genies using the dark magic against it. Ah, oh, oh, man. <laughs> Which one's open? Man, this is insane. Trying to dodge everything. Oh, God. Oh, of course I missed that. Hmm. Hold on.
Ugh, of course. Had to tend to the cats real quick. Oh, come on, just... And then quit spinning. Don't really have much to work with now. Oh, wow. I, I gotta be careful. Okay, I can't afford to get hit. Ah, oh. <laughs> this is hard. All right, back here again. <laughs> yeah, unfortunately, I had to do the the battles beforehand just to even get a chance to do this again. So it took some time. Oh, come on. All right, this is one. <laughs> and of course, luckily I did get a few oranges in case I do need them. Ah, oh, of course it hits the very edge. I mean, it's like I'm trying to look through the background and foreground at the same time. See if there's any attacks that are going to happen. Oh, man. Hold on. Alright, sorry about that. Oh. Don't know which... <laughs> which one's even active right now. I can't tell. Oh, wow, this is insane. I don't know which one is active. Man, <laughs> come on, it's insane. Of course. Man, just at the very edge. <laughs> I'm getting attacked by everything at once. Wait, 
Got a few oranges. <laughs> Come on, just a little bit more. There you go. <laughs> oh, man. A little bit challenging. Oh, man. <laughs> Fool. Blasted no good. F <laughs> Wretched meddling runt. You've ruined everything. My perfect, perfect plan. I almost had it all. But now... I have the satisfaction of sending you straight to a fiery grave. <laughs> oh no, the whole place is coming down. I gotta get out of here. <laughs> oh, look at that. Huh? What's this? You got zombie hamster. Just kind of random, okay? Hang on tight, we're getting out of here. <laughs> okay. So, uh... Yeah, just, I guess, escape out of this place. <laughs> Try to do my best to avoid getting hurt. Oh, man, the lava is coming closer. Ow. The lava's taking about half of the screen. <laughs> oh, of course. Well, at least I don't have to start back from the last save spot. I mean, that'd be a real shame if I had to, if I died and I had to redo the entire boss fights all over again. That would just be a real harsh punishment. Just for falling. <sighs> Just gotta keep sliding down. Of course, it got hit. Ain't that nice. Oh, thank God. <laughs> At least I got it that time. Yay! Everything's destroyed. <laughs> I guess. That's good. That was a close call too. Close. <laughs> Thanks for li the lift, Sky. Uh, something, someone's got to keep an eye on you. <laughs> Looks like Sequin Land is safe from evil once again. <laughs> yep, thanks to our half-genie hero. <laughs> Couldn't have done it without you guys. Hold up there. Mayor? 
so uh scuttle town is more or less repaired and the position of guardian genie is still open are you trying to ask shantae something mayor <laughs> Uh, okay, I can't think of anyone more qualified than you. Will you come back? Pretty please? <laughs> I never even left. Phew, thought I was gonna have to put on a little red outfit and start dancing around, you know. <laughs> oh, Mayor. So I guess I won't do that then. Yeah. Anyway, everyone say hello to the new Guardian Genie of Scuttletown. Yay! <laughs> I think he made an excellent choice. Kids. <laughs> Thank goodness you made it out in one piece. When I saw the eruption, I feared I lost you. <laughs> I'm fine, and Seagram Land is safe thanks to you guys. Yeah, I helped out a lot this time. Feeling pretty heroic, you know? <laughs> Think I'll start a dojo, start training up the next round of, of heroes. Gotta dream big. I'm going to take off too. My brother Abner, my brothers Abner and Poe, they're thinking about renovating that old mansion up north. How cool. I'm going to help them out, but after that, well, I think I'm going to find the zombie caravan and travel a bit. I miss my wagon and I want to see more of the world. And you should come with me. Zombie road trip? <laughs> sure, why not? <laughs> Let me chew on it. Take good care. <laughs> Thank you, care of Dookie. <laughs> huh? Pose hamster. I better get going too. I need to feed Wrench and get him cleaned up. You never did tell me how he managed to grow so big. What's your secret? It's a special diet. Salted caramel for birds. Wrench goes nuts for him. <laughs> I see. I think I'm gonna set him free for a while so he can spend time with his family. Knowing Wrench, he won't be gone long. He's crazy about you. And I'm crazy about him right back. Well, at least that solves how Wrench got big. Uh, my, my, my. What an adventure you had. I'm sorry about the dynamo, Uncle. No, no, that's alright. How about you? Are you okay? What really happened back there? Risky used the dynamo to change the genie realm from good to evil. For a short while, I was actually there in the genie room with them it's something i've always dreamt of but to stop risky i had to well they're all gone now i'm sorry i know you only did what was required what you had to do understand i'm sure your mother would have been very proud of you we're all proud of her what who She acted selflessly to put the needs of others before her own. Then, the genie room is safe? <laughs> yes. By purifying our magic and turning it against the machine, you saved us all. Wow, I guess your polarizer did the trick, uncle. Haha, <laughs> so it did. <laughs> and what about my mother? Is she safe too? Your mother is alive and well in the genie room. She has devoted herself to the protection of your world. She and the other genies must remain here where their combined powers can ward off the greater evils that would seek to enter your world. This is why she had to leave so long ago, along with the other genies. It was to protect us? Yes, so you could grow up under the safety and care of your uncle. She wanted you to know this, but only when you were old enough to understand the meaning of her sacrifice. I understand. <laughs> she also wants you to know that you are never alone. There was a special magic, a gift that she has placed upon your heart. For real? Your family is never as far away as you might think. Take comfort in knowing that she is with you, always. She loves you, very much. And now I must return to the genie realm. If you see my mother, tell her that I understand what she's done for us, and that I love her right back. I will tell her. Good luck. And to you. Come on, Uncle. Where are we going? To celebrate, of course. And to find you a new, less dangerous hobby. <laughs> that reminds me, I recently unearthed designs for something called a bicycle. For the next project, I'm going to build one for you. <laughs> okay. Hey, Uncle, wait up. <laughs> 
Until next time, daughter of genies, goodbye and farewell. Yep, and that's pretty much it. <laughs> right, there you have it. Shantae, half genie hero. <laughs> I, mean, I gotta say, overall, um, I mean, the game itself wasn't too bad. Well, I mean, granted, this was hardcore difficulties, and I and I uh, wanted a challenge. Yeah, this was a pretty good challenge. I mean, there are times I kind of had to uh, take some time to just try to find stuff to help me out. You know, and, and I think this is actually a pretty good uh, difficulty for those who are kind of more veteran into platformers, because uh, honestly, normal difficulty was just way too easy. Especially in the, uh, if you manage to get all the gallery keys and get the tiara to get unlimited magic, you, you can just totally break the game. So I mean, at least here it was more balanced, <laughs> and I did, and I do like that. Uh, I mean, for the graphics itself, it wasn't too bad. I, I did like it. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it has a kind of an interesting style. It kind of reminds me of um, the Rayman Legends or Rayman Origins, you know, the, that kind of series. It, it had that similar style to it. And, uh, you know, I don't know, said gameplay, I mean, it's typical Shantae, if you ever played Shantae in the past, it's the same as before. And, uh, well, all the transformation stuff, at least it wasn't as, uh, obnoxious, I guess, compared to the first couple of games. But, you know, some of the transformations weren't that really used too often, <laughs> I can say that. They were just more situational than anything else. I mean, I'd say most of the time I was using the monkey. Well, I'd say the monkey and the harpy are, are your best best options there you know, if we were traveling like on land and on sea i would say go with the the mermaid <laughs> but uh i mean overall it wasn't too bad of a game i guess yeah a little bit on the short side <laughs> i'd say roughly it was like about a four to five hour game <laughs> i mean that's uh, assuming that you had really didn't try to complete everything <laughs> but at least luckily there's still dlc with this and uh, you know uh, hopefully some more stuff will be coming out. I mean, at this point, uh, uh, throughout the Kickstarter, they have they have reached their goals for certain things, so I'm just waiting for that. All right, uh, I think we're gonna fast forward a little bit through the credits here because it's just gonna be a while. <laughs> well, at least they give me the option to actually fast forward credits is a pretty good thing. All right, <laughs> the end. <laughs> So playtime, four hours and forty-three minutes. Yeah, typical. Item collection, eighty-three percent. I mean, if I had bought everything, it would have been a hundred, you know. But I did pretty much complete everything in every stage, so yeah. Oh yeah, bonus image game clear. <laughs> of course, there's actually four images you can get: one for completing the game, one for getting getting 100% in the game, uh, one for beating the, the game in like two hours, and I guess another, no, sorry, three hours, beating the game in three hours, and then beating the game, what, 100% in three hours, <laughs> which, uh, I mean, it's possible, but there, I mean, I did manage to do it, it's just um, gonna be times where you're gonna have to uh, do a little bit of safe scumming just to help you out, <laughs> and also at times where you're gonna be grinding and doing a little bit of a trick to get gems as quickly as possible. But yeah, that's pretty much it. <laughs> All right, guys. Um, yeah, I mean, I'm probably going to jump into the uh, the DLC, uh, Pirate's Queen's Quest, you know, playing the game is risky. It's been a while since I've done that one, too. So I guess I'll look forward to that one. All right, guys, this is Devon XYZ, and until next time.